What is the armor layout? What is that there? Oh my god. It looks pretty squishy to be honest. But the guns look great. What else can we build for? What's this ability? Honestly, let's build it like this. We don't want top grid gunner. <clears throat> That's some huge nerves for this ship. Jesus. But who knows? Maybe it's justified. I know. I don't know. I've never played this ship. Let's see how it goes. Is Forest Tremens still in the A? Yes, it is. It's a Jeremy ship, yeah. I love how they're like, we need a flag here, we need a flag here. We need a flag here, we need like flags everywhere. My god. I do have high hopes though that this flag might debate people and think the citadel is here. I'm just waiting that people shoot here because of the flag. <laughs> oh wait, it has only AP. Oh my god, okay. So, we got a Spanish captain as well. Buen viento y buena mar. <laughs> interesting. Very interesting. Canaris and uh, Dido, yep. Yeah. Canaris. <laughs> it doesn't get torps. It really has only guns though. Oh, the ballistics. Let's, let's see. Ballistic looks looked okay. Yeah, this flag is this flag is bad. This one is good because it's gonna be over pens. This one is gonna be terrible for us. Hey Panzer Kicks. Solicito fuego de apoyo. <laughs> hmm. How fast can this boy go in a straight line? 15% speed boost. Oh, damn. 15. For over 3 minutes. Oh, damn. Can you play this Vasta Bone stream? No, it's under NDA. Sorry. It's pretty fast. Remember, we don't have a speed flag. With a speed flag, you could throw 40 knots. That's a speedy boy. Sounds pretty okay, honestly. Not bad. What's the fight draw? 4k I'm okay, nothing special there. But nice to have. Range for 60.2 is good. We can work with that even in an up tier. Reporting the position of a strategic target. Does anybody know if it has improved AP angles or something? Or why does it only have AP? Is that just a normal decision? Wait, that's... <coughs> that's Proys. That's Proys there. Detectado. 
The guns are really nice to aim. Ooh. Only pens. That would be a nice gimmick. A ship that always pens and cannot overpen. <laughs> oh, that would be so busted. It doesn't have better angles. Does it also have short fuse? Because it feels like it. I have not have a single overpen yet. Yeah, I don't get any. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. I do understand why they heavily nerfed this ship already. Improved AP angles, two of these, good reload. Yeah. The roof is six, uh, six angel firing from it. Yeah, but that's a good thing, I think. Imagine you have a burst fire with these guns on a cruiser. And you can evaporate them, even if he's a tier high or something. Let's see if we can settle the now, but that would be already great. No citadel yet. He's trying to dodge. Okay. It's so funny to not get any overpants. <laughs> Hi, boys. Problema resuelto, señor. Acorazado enemigo detectado. Oh, Amagi. Uh... Sobre alimentación activada. <sighs> okay. No armor, best armor. Chat, no armor, best armor, as you can see. <clears throat> we need to watch out here. Can we get the NC? Mm, darn it. Necesito información de inteligencia. Attention, reporting the target position. Oof. Oof. Northern Reefer just subscribed. Happy birthday, Trendless. It's so crazy we share the same day. <laughs> Thank you, Northern Reefer. Thank you so much and welcome back. Thank you for 15 months, my dude. <clears throat> Thank you so much. Come on. Nice. Okay, not a bad sub. The guns are pretty nice.
cool spot, I mean. I must be DD here. Alarma de incendio. Let's run, let's run, let's run, let's run. Problema resuelto, señor. It's the Spanish cruiser Canarias upcoming. You can obtain obtain the next patch for free in part of an event. You can either choose this or the Dido. Both seem to be solid chips. But I want to see how punishing. Oh damn! I want to see how punishing this ship can be if somebody is really showing for broadside of the cruiser. <coughs> That's the real test for me. Can you buy the other one? Yes, you could potentially buy the other one, but you have to choose one. You can obtain one for free. The other one, if you really want them, you can buy them, of course. I like the speed, and we have not a single overpen, right? Yeah, look at this. Not a single overpen. I don't I think attack was gonna go like this, right? Or is it? <coughs> well. Oh wow, nice, nice meme. Okay, the Atago Yolo, really. Interesting. There's the Aoba again. Let's turn around and go for the Aoba and Trumpkong and the Colorado. Hmm. Welcome back. Come on, this is the perfect opportunity in the back. Come on, oh, not enough lead, over. Okay. Let's try again. This time proper lead. Okay, nice. You can do it. <coughs> That's great. That's great. Oh, that's gonna be juicy. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Okay. Nuestra victoria está cerca. Yo, that AP is pretty nasty.
the first overpen in the game, chat. I think. Yeah. One overpen, 70 pence. <laughs> oh, GG. Full up tier. That was not bad. GG. And look at the shots in the middle. We didn't really get punished. Do you see all the shots in the middle of my ship? We didn't get punished. I think it's quite... It's so lightly armored that it's not that easy to settle unless it's fully angled. GG. Canarias. Tier 6 and Tier 8 game. It's fast. The guns sit like a truck. But remember, chat. There is something you really need to remember. There is gonna be... The reload time is at the moment 10.5. It's gonna be nerfed by release to 12 seconds, so 1.5 seconds more. The shell damage is gonna be reduced from 4500 citadel damage to 3800, so that's a 700, um, 700 less per citadel. Round about, I think like 13% nerf overall per shot damage should be around about 13% or something. I'm not the exact value right now, but. Or fifteen percent, nearly actually. There's also tech changes of the AP shell parameters, but the penetration and ballistics are the same. I don't know exactly what they need with that. Mean with that, maybe they're gonna fly something or whatever. But they go should be the same. I don't. If it, I don't know if it, that's gonna affect anything. And the concealment is gonna be nerfed by seven hundred meters. Right now. This is a great trip. It's really great. The nurse will make it weaker, but overall the speed is not touched. The rudder shift is not touched. I don't know that shell thingy if it's gonna make the penetrate overpens more often, but it's insane. Look at this. We got one overpen out of 70. It's if this stays like this. I mean, you can choose between the Canarias and the Dido. Honestly, I will probably go with this ship. Because remember, I was fighting a lot of tier 8s here, and we could still, if you aim for the upper belt, you can punish them. But you saw, if that Aoba show broadside, we can Citadel him. So on tier 6, I think this is going to be a pretty nasty ship. Because you can play, like, you have 60, they're not going to change the range, and you have 16.2 km range, and that's really nice for a cruiser. That's, that's a solid range. Plus, you're so hard of paper that a lot of times people just overpen on you, unless, of course, they get the lucky shot. <coughs> GG. It's a great ship. I, uh, great ship. From right now, I don't know how bad the nerves will affect the Canarios, but for right now, I think it's a way more interesting ship than Dido, and I would take this one. That's a lot of range. It's super fast. It can reach up to 40 knots with a speed flag. Good ship. Or 39 something. It's a great ship. I would take this one if I had to choose right now. It feels way more... I don't know. Solid. Great, great boat. I recommend this one from my point right now. I don't, I mean the nerves are hard, don't get me wrong, but I guess they're justified, I mean, yeah, GG. And god, god forbid, luckily this thing has not the burst fire anymore, you've seen what the AP can do, now imagine I would have done a burst fire on a cruiser or something if I had the chance. <clears throat> god forbid that part. 